All right, today I'm gonna to show you how to charge a cell phone. Right here, I have a cell phone, and I'm gonna show you various ways on how you can get this going, how you can charge it. All right, so right here, the cell phone, and if you look at the bottom of the cell phone, there should be some sort of port. Now this port right here could be a USB-C, which this one is right here, or it could be a uh, lightning uh, cable that you plug in. So iPhones, some of the older models have a lightning cable where you plug it into here to actually charge it. All right, so this is one of the newer models of the iPhone and it uses a USB-C, which is similar to other phones that are made by Samsung, uh, um, Motorola perhaps, uh, other companies, LG and Google Android phones typically have this USB-C port for plugging it in. And I'm gonna go over how to charge it with the USB-C, as well as the MagSafe, or the magnetic charging. So some of the newer phones actually have wireless charging where it actually charges uh, by sitting the uh, device on the back of the phone and it charges it wirelessly. And I'm gonna go through that as well. Uh, but before I get to that, I'm gonna show you the USB-C. Before I get to the wireless charging, I'm gonna show you the USB-C charging, which is a classic uh, charging. Uh, if you have an older model iPhone, you will use a lightning wire to plug this in. Now right here, I have a charger. This is made for American outlets. There's actually make some for European where it has the prongs that are different. Uh, well, either way, this is the fast charger. You can see it's stained a little bit in an older charger. And this right here is a 20 watt charger. So some of the newer phones can handle up to 20 watt charging. Uh, I, th I think even some of the newer, newer phones are, can handle up to 30 watts. And I've even seen some people using some of the laptop chargers, uh, uh, plugs for uh, their phones, which has a significantly higher wattage. Now, I recommend that you listen to the manufacturer as to the limits of the wattage for the charger and the recommended charger for charging your phone. Um, listen to what they say. So I have this 20 watt charger and you can see that it has a USB-C plug right here. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna plug the cable, it's a USB-C plug into that. So once that's secure, making sure my hand's dry, make sure your hands are dry when doing this, I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in to an outlet. You see there's an outlet on the side of this lamp. I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in like that. And with the other side, which is also a USB-C, I'm going to plug this in to the bottom where the USB-C port is. Now it's important to make sure that there's no lint or debris or dirt stuck inside of this port right here, or else your phone will not be able to charge. So once I've made sure that there's no dirt, debris, or lint stuck in there, I'll take the USB-C end and I'll plug this in to right here. And when you see this, you'll see that it is 80% charged right here. It's 80% charged and it is starting, it is charging the phone. You'll notice it right here, it says USB, it says right there, it says 80% and it's still going. All right, so I have that in place right there. And so now uh, it's charging and it'll keep on charging until it gets to the top of 100%. Okay, so this is the classic way to charge um, the phone is by using cable. Next, I'm gonna show you how to charge using wireless. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take this out, USB-C cable out. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to now place this on top of this base. Now this is a wireless charging base right here. Okay, so it says wireless charger. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this, place it on top, center it up. And when it detects it, it will automatically begin charging. Do you see this? And when it's done, you can just go ahead and pull this off. Now, with wireless charging, there is no cable. You just place it down and pick it up when you need to. When it's off, it doesn't charge. When it's on properly, it will charge. And one thing to note, 
Uh, when it comes to the speed of charging, generally speaking, it charges faster when using the USB-C or lightning cable to charge the phone. All right, so that is how you charge a cell phone, both with the cable and wireless charging. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks a lot for watching.